Traders at the Bupe market in the northern region are worried with the sanitation condition of the market. The market has no proper drainage system and so anytime it rains, rainwater gets stuck into the market causing discomfort to traders and motorists. Some of the traders disclose to join news how the situation is affecting their businesses. You saw how bad the place looks when you arrived here. It disturbs us a lot. We are not supposed to be selling food in such a filthy environment, but what can we do? We have no choice. So please, come and assist us. This place smells a lot because of the stagnant rainy water, and as a result, traders don't even come around to buy our goods. For Nuapo Frederick, who has been a mobile money vendor for the past four years, the situation is heavily affecting trade and could lead to the outbreak of cholera if not checked. For sure, it's, it's affecting trade because when you can imagine, you can imagine how the place is flat, uh, like muddy. People try to balance themselves, you know, the muddy, they try to balance and then some of the reckless drivers and what have you, they come around trying to like, prove that, no, they are supposed to move themselves out of where they are passing. You know, they are also trying to, you know, if you see, if you can see a car moving, instead of him taking this way, you know, because of the water, he want to, you know, uh -huh, washing and what have you, they take it to be like uh, they want to maneuver themselves out of, you see, so that way, no, even a challenge. Yeah, it's possible because cholera comes by these uh, flies and what have you. So, you see, when it happens this way, um, uh, uh, looking at something like this, flies go, takes anything that you don't know, then when you buy food and you don't cover it well, at the end of the day, disease from any angles can come over. Cholera to be precise it's possible you will get that asked if authorities have not been responding to the situation because the traders do not pay their tolls frederick indicated that market authorities do come for tolls every market day we are paying tickets even me mobile money credit tra uh, tra transfer and whatever i pay tickets so it is just that we, we are always pleading on the management to try and make sure they do what they are supposed to do so that all these kind of uh, diseases will, come, will not come around. Uh -huh. But uh, we don't know how much they are sending it forward. They will pay market tools. They don't even sweep the market. We do it ourselves. To the drivers who visit the market, the situation is affecting their businesses in diverse ways. From the roadside to this end, the route is damaged. Sometimes passengers get knocked down by vehicles and the situation is affecting our cars. And we are not able to send goods inside the market, so we call for help. The market needs to be worked on. Even where to park our cars is a problem. So we call on them to do something about it. To these traders who spoke to join news, they want authorities to check the situation as well as provide containers where they can dump their wastes. We have no containers, so when we sweep around, we dump the refuse in the bush. So we need containers. From Bupe in the northern region, I am Anas Sabit for Joy News.